It's great place. to see you. Yeah, come I do here come often. here often. <laughs> should be great. Definitely in the right place, yeah, mate. It will be brilliant. <laughs> yeah, looking forward to it. Good to see you. I'm a rebel. <laughs> it would appear we're in just the right place at just the right time. There is no time left for grudges. The past can't define our future. There is no time left for stubbornness. It's time we embrace understanding and empathy. And there is no time left for hate. Let's break the cycle and replace it with love. Above all, there is only time left to give our hearts to God. He can heal and transform us. In a world scarred by the horrors of domestic violence, child abuse, suicides, narcissistic abuse, and broken families, we must rise above the pain. There are people who understand how much it hurts to carry the weight of abuse. It's not an easy journey. What you have suffered, what you have endured, should not define you. Refuse to let these experiences define who you really are. If you've suffered, know that you can rise above it. Seek help, find support, and break free from the chains of victimhood. To my family and friends, let's be part of the healing process. Let's put aside the feelings of abandonment, the feelings of regret, the attitude of discarding the past and people who you don't feel is worthy to be in your presence. Instead, let's learn from our mistakes and move forward as family and friends. Let's put an end to the cycle of abuse and resentment. Together, we can create a better future. We may have been divided, but now we have the chance to come together, rebuild and find peace and closure. Let's embrace God's love and forgiveness. In His hands, we can transform our lives and our relationships. There is no time left in this world to disregard and abandon our own family. Let's break the cycle and find healing through love, forgiveness and our faith in God.